Hey, so sometimes objects, things, you know, they become more than things. Uh, they become links to memories. This flashlight has been used in my family for a lot of years. It was bought at JCPenney, and uh, one of the kids have used it, and I got a lot of, a lot of memories, a lot of good links to this. But as you know, flashlights have changed over the years. Today, they're cheap pieces of plastic with, you know, LED lights. Uh, you can't replace the bulbs because supposedly an LED light lasts forever and da 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 da, -da. And, and most people, when, they, when the thing breaks, they'll just throw it away. But today, I'm gonna show you how to take one of these old flashlights and convert it to LED. And what that does is you're gonna get a lot more life out of the two D-cell batteries in here, and it's gonna be 200 lumens as opposed to the 35 lumens that it is now. So stick with me, it's gonna get pretty interesting. Okay, so here's a before test with the flashlight with the current bulb. Okay, see if you can make that out. In fact, I'll get it down close there. All right, that is the current bulb that's in there right now. That served me. That bulb has been in this flashlight since 1970, believe it or not, but it still works. And that's what it puts out right now. I'm not sure how many lumens that is, but I'm going to go ahead and do the conversion and you guys get an idea of, you know, do you notice a marked uh, mark change in the, uh, in the flashlight? But this is the old bulb that I'm utilizing here. And let's get it out at distance here. So you can see that's what you get at distance. Okay. Okay, so I want to walk you through the conversion method in case you decide to do this yourself. This is how the conversion method is done. What we're going to do is we're going to unscrew our flashlight, and that's the housing, the optics, okay? And we're going to take this little part out right here. We're going to unscrew this. And as you can see, that's the old bulb right there. So that's our old bulb right there. I'm going to set that aside, set that grommet down, okay? And then we're going to take this thing out. Now this is the uh, Lightstar Corporation. As you can see it's supposed to give you 200 lumens. We're going to test that too. First we got to get out of the package and I thought, you know what would be good for this? My trusty pocket knife. This is an old Camp King. One day I'm going to do a video on this because it's a great uh, pocket knife. And like it's nobody's business. Slice right through that hard plastic and everything. And we'll get her open get the new bulb out of there. You can see what it says there, LED conversion kit. Let's set that out of the way and let's try this out. We're going to get this thing here, slide it right in there. It looks like it slides right in. Let's get that knife out of our hand so I don't cut my hand and uh, we'll screw it back in there. And now it's a matter of just putting it back in the housing screwing it back on. That's the conversion right there. When you do your flashlight, give it, give it a little extra turn, not too much, but a little extra so that no moisture gets in there. And now it should be ready to go. We're going to try it out in the dark. But I'll tell you what I'm going to do is save this old bowl because uh, apparently these are hard to find now. And, uh, you know, it still works from 1970 to right now. You never want to touch the glass on the bulb. I mean, I do sometimes because I forget, but I can remember when I was being trained to do some of this stuff, they said never touch the bulb. Ah. But now I've got this LED in here. We're going to see how she does. So stick with me. This is going to get pretty interesting. Okay. This is where the new LED bulb. Wow. That's night. That's night and day. What an amazing difference. Wow. Hmm. Stay safe, stay warm, stay free.